Hello, guys. My name is Shirley. Today, we are going to make this girl with earring card holder. Firstly, we are going to sew this ring. Fix at this location. This is the finished effect. The thread length for sewing this line will take three times of the finger distance, such as one, two, three. Okay, this is the total length. After measuring the thread length, we are going to have the needle threaded. We will need two needles at two ends of the thread. Press your thread on the desk and have your needle go through it. And then draw the short end, make it tight, same as the other end. Okay, now we have the needle goes through the first hole and draw the same distance of two ends of the thread. Beneath needle go upward and upward needle go downward at the same hole. Okay, we were going to repeat all these steps. Okay, when we sew until the last hole, leave the beneath needle downward and have the upward needle go downward. Leave the two ends of the thread at the same size and make two ties before cutting off. Okay, now we will apply the leather glue on the thread. Only on the thread. Try to avoid on the leather. Press the glue a little bit more to make it more fixed and then cut two ends of the thread. There is no need to cut too close about the thread, leave a few space. Now is the finish effect about the first line. Now we move on to the another leather piece. The thread distance of this line will take five times of the finger distance.
fixing the location, we will start from the first hole, which is only one layer. And then move to the next hole, which has two layers overlaps together. Repeat the steps as we showed before. To finish all holes, we will go back to holes to end the thread. Leave two ends of the thread at the same size. Like this way. And then cut the thread. We could apply the leather glue on the thread. Or if you don't have the leather glue, we can use the lighter. I will show you how to use the lighter to end the thread. Same as the leather glue, go back to horse and then leave two ends of the thread at the same size. Cut off the thread not too close about the leather so leave more space to melt and then get the fire to melt the ends of the thread not too close about the leather just to avoid burn the leather okay next step we are going to sew the second triangle shape leather piece. The thread distance will also take 5 times of the finger distance shows. Ok, I will leave you guys to finish this thread. It will be same as the last one. Now we move on to another steps. We were going to sew these two pieces together. Start from these two lines. The longer line and the short line. This longer line will take 7 times of the finger distance. And the short line will take 4 times of the finger distance. Here I will show how to sew the long thread. All the lines here are in the same way. They ends at the back by tightening two ties. I will show one of the lines here. Okay, so until the last hole, 
I will show you how to end the thread. Now we leave the last hole blanket, have the beneath needle stay there and have the upper needle go downward. Then we are going to get two ties here directly. Okay, if you have the leather glue apply on the thread directly before cutting off the thread. But if you don't have the leather glue, cut the thread first and have your lighter to melt the thread. Okay, for the second line, it will take four times of the finger distance. This is the first hole and this is the last hole. Okay, so I will leave you guys to finish this line. This is the finish effect. The ending thread method is same as the long line. So I will leave you guys to finish this line. Next step, we are going to overlap these two leather pieces together and going to sew these four lines. One, two, three, four. The thread length of these three lines will take four times of the finger distance. Lines will take seven times of the finger distance. These four lines will end at the same way by getting two ties at the back. I'll show you one of the lines here. Okay, same way of sewing the left three lines. This line will take also four times and the short will also the four times and the long will take seven times. So here I will leave you guys to finish the last steps. The last step, we are going to sew all the leather pieces together. By sewing all these leather pieces, we we'll use only one thread line. 
the thread line for this area will take 12 times of the finger distance that I show. This is the thread line to go over the car holder. The initial hole and the last hole will have a circle to end the thread. I will show how to sew this line by starting a circle. After going the first hole, and we'll make a circle at the first hole here. Okay. Now the left steps will be same as usual. Okay, I will leave you guys to finish the left steps and until the last hole here, it will be seen as the first hole by making a circle. I will show you again about making this circle. Okay, finish the circle and go back to holes. The thread ends both the same size. We'll cut the thread. Use your leather glue or the lighter to mail the ends. Okay, now we have finished this car holder. Hope you guys enjoy this process. Thank you for watching.